Good afternoon or good morning for the Caribbean and uh, good evening or almost good night for those uh, in Malaysia, India. Um, it is about 3.30 uh, Friday uh, afternoon on 27th of June and um, finally it is quite warm here in uh, uh, the, where CPTM Smart Partners Hub is but um, at the same time there are benefits of that um, which is um, quite a lot of strawberries and when you see strawberries in the UK you almost think of tennis, those who play tennis think of Wimbledon, except the Wimbledon this year, never mind uh, uh, Murray, um, is competing with Brazil and obviously we should, would do so. Um, the uh, World Cup. But uh, today uh, we're just trying to mark as part of the countdown to all the smart partnership uh, gathering, think tanking in uh, uh, South Africa for 2014, uh, the 15 weeks that uh, we have, uh, and um, um, we're also trying to see in what way we could fast track the uh, next three months and so, or 15 weeks to come, uh, in such a way that uh, the expectations which were built up, uh, taking forward the things that took place, issues that took place, um, and were approached in uh, Dar es Salaam so successfully, as well as since then, um, they are being uh, built into a fabric of an interaction um, in South Africa which do justice to the smart partnership movement and to the host, of course. Um, the one uh, thing that uh, uh, we announced is that we are trying to again put together the wisdom that has been expressed as it was expressed uh, by fellows and uh, um, heads of government, former heads of government, since then um, uh, into what since 1997 is being referred to as the Smart Partnership Movement's Manifesto, um, Limitless Opportunities Through Smart Partnership Manifesto. Um, uh, through smart partnership and there is a manifesto related to that. Um, there is a very great um, uh, uh, temptation to add to the uh, manifesto um, from all of us the wisdom, the um, um, philosophy that goes around it and um, I suppose what one needs to attach to this very special type of manifesto is the demonstrable practice connected to the specific situations that there are global groupings of various geopolitical groupings up to the country level, organizational level, or village level. So I, I was gathering uh, to try to see how uh, other, in, in other professions, how others are looking at what one calls manifesto in that profession or in that grouping. And uh, the manifesto is not necessarily only connected to, or the movement, connected to a political movement, those that are very well known. There, is a ma there are manifestos which expresses progressiveness and galvanizes new generations um, uh, and um, um, connected to architecture, connected to um, uh, various uh, interactions. There are all movements and a manifesto towards that particular uh, uh, aim, such as limitless, 
so smart partner smart partnership is supposed to consist of as people said it the way of galvanizing the new generation um, to come so wisdom uh, embedded in relation to various aspects of smart partnership practice from uh, for instance uh, the various speeches delivered per, by Tun Dr. Mahathir um, while he was um, uh, uh, since 1995 up to the time when uh, he retired and um, uh, we are just doing that and we'll try to see in what way in addition to uh, other uh, contributions we will try to enrich as it happened uh, the manifesto um, manifesto of the smart partnership movement couldn't be more relevant for this year uh, gathering in South Africa but also for the kind of uh, major shifts that are taking place and which we are part of it such as in relation to global governance and new wars and such as uh, trends, big trends of merging uh, development approaches in, in developing countries with growth and prosperity uh, type of uh, approaches uh, which allows a public security which is not only related to security in its own uh, context but also related to uh, energy security for public as a public good, uh, food security, um, and all the other aspects of security. So uh, the smart partnership connected to priorities related to developing, continue to develop on one hand, as well as to grow rapidly through also leveraging technology will try to aim at limitless opportunity for achieving public security as a public good in the context of energy, digital, security, food, and so on. So uh, various things in uh, today's uh, email are being highlighted about progress that is taking place, and uh, it becomes very hot, hot, in terms of discussions, in terms of the rhythm that we have to uh, undertake uh, in a fast track mode, both in terms of pulling together and focusing issues, uh, our chairman keeps reminding us, but also in terms of matching that with those who are particularly able to articulate and integrate a national vision, carrying forward a national vision in the context of an integrated interaction rather than only one specific uh, uh, sector. And that is a very difficult one, but this is what means smart partnership practice. And that is what is going to take place in July in various interactions among the members. So. Have a nice weekend and hope you continue to watch or to uh, be uh, happy or to we commiserate with those who are uh, uh, whose uh, specific uh, national team, football teams are losing or winning. So uh, all the best.